Yes. 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 Oh, yes, yes, yes. As you recognize that you are free to decide which path you will take. You understand that there is no wrong way for you to proceed. Because if there was, you would not be allowed to choose. You would only be able to take the one true path. So, the path that is right for you today may not be right for you tomorrow. And this can be unsettling for many of you. Because you want to stay on the path of righteousness. On the path of truth. You want to be on the path that leads you to everything that you want. And that is why so many of you find it challenging to even be on planet Earth. There are so many forces pulling you in so many different directions. And then there are your parents' beliefs. And then there is what the government wants from you. And then you have friends. Who want you to be like them. And all of it distorts your view of life. And you become bewildered by the choices. So our recommendation to you 
is to choose moment by moment. Step by step. See the most interesting path as the one that is the most crooked, the least logical, the most circuitous. Those are the paths of adventure. Those are the paths of the seeker. And through endless changes in your preferences, in your beliefs, and in your behaviors, you know yourselves more as God than a person walking the straight and narrow. For God is all things, all experiences, all paths. If you want to create the perfect path for yourself, and take as many detours as you possibly can. Because one thing is certain. You cannot go back You cannot regress. You cannot undo the expansion that has occurred with every step. Allow your path to be your own. Ask no one else to follow you. And know that the less people you see on your path, the more you can be assured that it is yours. Enjoy your journey. Seek not to get it right. Be willing to be wrong, to make mistakes. To lose your way. That is truly how you find yourself. We are Michael. We are infinite. We are